Okay, Safeway is smart in that they, when they make their own food, they don't need to have that nutritional profile that'll give you how much protein, how many carbs, how many sugars, how much fiber is added to this. They don't need to do that when they make their own food. All they need to do is put the ingredient list because we can't decipher what actually is in this product. What's in this Bagels Energy Bar 6 count? That's $2.99. I've tried it. I got this from the food bank. It's expired, but uh, a lot of this processed food can last beyond that expiration. I don't see any kind of rot. It's very addictive. Do not eat. That's the ultimate conclusion. I'm throwing the rest away. I would never feed this to a squirrel. There's too much... Uh, sugar sweetness added to it that makes it extra addictive delicious so it's definitely no good all right I found myself taking bite after bite I've probably eaten this is the half two and a half out of the six counts I guess yeah it's two and a half left I have to stop it's cake that's all it is it's cake without the frosting. It's it's a bagel cake without the frosting. Okay, and I have no clue how much sugar was added. You got sugar. You got raisins, which are sweet. Okay, you got, yeah, you got walnuts. I, I didn't suspect where those walnuts are. Uh, apples. How many of the apples? Steel cut oats. I couldn't decipher. I can't decipher most of this stuff. Okay, it's just a glob of, of uh, like, some baked thing together. I don't think there's enough um, bran. I don't think there's enough fiber in it. But uh, it's, uh, it's interesting how these uh, stores, these grocery stores, are getting around food labels by making their own food. Walmart does it with Sam's Club, Safeway... Others do it, but uh, yeah, it's it's something that I would say do not even take a first bite of. If you try it, you're going to want to try a few of them, and uh, then you'll hate yourself for it like I do.